Okay, uh, what I'm gonna show you now is a bit of a design feature that you could use in your design, and it's where we take a corner and sort of pop it in. You might be, might be a bit hard to understand, but once I'm finished, you'll know what I'm talking about. The first thing we need is a vertical line down our piece of paper. Now, this only really works on a square design. So what I'm showing you is just one corner. On your paper model, you're gonna to have to divide it up perfectly into four bits with your joining tab, and then just do this design feature on one of those corners. So here's a line down there. Imagine that's one of my corners. I'm then just gonna pick, it doesn't matter how far or how high this is, it can be any distance, but I'm lining up my paper along the grid on my cutting mat, and I'm just gonna put a bit of a horizontal line across there, and another horizontal line across here, lining up my ruler with the grid so that I know that they're horizontal. And then I'm gonna come out, oh, let's say two centimeters or 20 mils either side. I might put my ruler in the middle so that I can do them both at once, like that. And down the bottom here, because I want them perfectly aligned. So four that way and that way. And then I'm gonna join those up with my pencil. And you're saying, Mr. Williams, that's pretty, that's not very interesting. It's just a box with some lines through the middle. But wait, okay, this is where it gets exciting. What we're gonna do is fold it along that edge and the middle and this edge, and we're gonna cut through on that edge. So what I'm actually going to do to make it easy to cut is to fold it just like I would on the edge of my box. You can sort of see that it's an edge of a box now. Okay, I'm gonna chop the top and the bottom, making very sure that I don't go past my line. And what I'm going to do is then push this inner section in. Now this is where it's a little bit tricky. Okay, you've got to kind of fold the paper in the direction that it doesn't really want to go. Okay, like that. And then these ones, I'm gonna poke out. And once I've done that, okay, have a look at that. All right, the bit's just in, the, in there. And then I'm gonna squish it down on those lines there. And when I fold that back out, all of a sudden, you get a nice design feature on the edge there. This section's popped in, and these other sections are left out. 